Hi, welcome to this Jandy Bash video for the review of the Tennis Tutor Pro Lite machine. Uh, this is going to be a relatively quick review. I'll just talk you through some of the functions of it. Here, it uh, has a carry handle. Uh, you tip the machine over onto the side, open up the top, reveals these four panels, and then within this, you put up to approximately a hundred tennis balls. This is the control panel for the machine. As you can see, we have the power button here, straightforward on off switch. This is to control the oscillator. This is the ball speed. And the other dial is the ball feed, which is basically how quickly you want the balls to come out in succession. These dials go from 1 to 10. The dial at the front controls the adjuster for the height that you wish the tennis ball to come out of the machine. Now uh, this is uh, obviously how the balls go in. I've only put four in here just to show you how the mechanism works. But like I said, you can put up to 100 in. So it's quite simple. It rotates. The ball drops down. And a couple of rubber bands just rifle the ball out. This is on one of the higher speed settings. Which is why it's just a bit of a blur when they come out at the end. Now here I'm just going to quickly show. Uh, again, not many balls going into the machine. But when you turn the power on it does give you about 10 seconds before the first ball comes out so enough time to just make your way around to the other side of the court you can see you have the oscillator on you can see it moving slightly to left and right just to give you an idea of how much it can turn um, as you can see I've probably not got it central so it's, it's favoring slightly more to the right but uh, it puts one over to the left and then uh, works his way back over for a backhand so that one's quite far over so I've, uh, I've not quite got it centered but you get the general idea from that so here I've got the machine set up slightly differently I've got the balls coming out a lot higher but the speeds down a bit so just here practicing some smashes thought I'd just show the lower end of the speed setting for the machine this probably won't be much used to majority of players but maybe if you're trained in children or something like that could be useful and that pretty much covers the functions of the machine uh, it's been a very brief review I know if you have any more in-depth questions please let us know we'll do our best to answer them and uh, please subscribe we're gonna have plenty more videos coming along which we hope you'll find useful